Hello everyone! In this video I will be showing you how to get access to the Pixel Mega Scans collection and how to import them into Lumion. So the first thing we need to do is we need to go to epicgames.com. You'll probably be thinking, why Epic Games? Well, that's because Quixel has joined forces with Epic Games in 2019 and made all the Mega Scans free to use for Unreal Engine users. Because it's from Epic Games, everyone that has an Epic Games account has now access to the entire Quixel library. So we first need to make an Epic Games account. If you already have an account, you can skip this part. For the others, you just go to the Epic Games website and press sign in and then follow the steps on the website. After that, we go to the Quixel.com website and press the sign in button. And then press the sign in with Epic Games button and select Epic Games. Then you log in with your email and password and now we have access to everything Quixel has to offer. So to access the assets of the 3D models that I want to show you is just search here in the search bar. So for example, as you can see, we're going to just find a rock. Now there are categories over here that they show you on what you probably might want, but uh, we just want the 3D assets. And we go to nature, we go to rocks, and let's go to with a mossy one. And let's import this forest boulder. We don't need the 8K because that's a really high resolution. It takes a lot of space and I think the 4K is fine. Of course you can use the 8K for your own projects, but I'm not going to do that for this video. Let's go over here because we need to transfer this to Lumion. We don't need all these elements. So what we need to do, download all of these. We don't want it. The high quality but not too low. I like to use the LOD 3 or 2. The 0 is the highest, 8 is the lowest. So I will like probably be or 2 or 3, depends on how big the element is. This is all we need for the textures. Albedo, that's the color, the normal, we need the displacement, roughness, specular. So then we go back and we can download and then just find a place in a folder. So in Lumion, we go and create a new project. We go to the plane environment because it's the easiest one. And then what we want to do is go to place and import a new model. Go to import a new model, go to your file that you just downloaded and let's go with the LOD2. Let's open this one. Uh, we can change the name and that's forest mossy folder or rest and we don't want it in the main category because otherwise we have all the polish roll. Uh, I made a Quixel mega scans. If you don't have this one yet you can just create a new folder and type the name over here. Let's import and as you can see now we have the boulder. But it needs textures. So we go to the materials, select the boulder and we go to load in all the textures that we have. Now this one, but this one, that's one. Let's go with the texture all the way 100%. Because the maps are imported and are made for this project, everything needs to be 100%. For the relief, we need a normal map, roughness, or placement map. And now we have a nice, mossy boulder. The cool thing about Lumion is that you can import all the models that you have and then create your own custom library. And it's also not project specific. So that means that if I open another project, for example, my realistic forest scene, if you haven't seen this video, I will put a chart right now. Uh, make sure to check that one out and go to the models, for example, the map pixel mega scans that I made, and you can open this one. And then you see the forest mossy boulder that we just created in another project. And you can also see it has textures and everything is also set up so that if I go now to the material, all the settings are the same as well. It is really powerful about Lumion. You can create your own custom library like this. So for the materials, it's really easy because we go here to the home and then we can select surfaces and then we have access to all the materials that Pixel has to offer. These are PRs and let's say you know more normal fabric plane. Let's go with this one. Keep it 4K for the highest resolution. What textures we need? We need the color, we need the normal, placement, the roughness, specular, and that's actually all we need. But let's go back and let's download this folder. So now we go back to Lumion, my re most recent project. If you haven't seen this video on how I made these renders, put the chart in the left corner again and make sure to watch that one. Then we need to go to the couch and let's go and change. We go to the new standard, so it resets and then we can create our own material, import all the textures. So now we have put all the 
materials in here and as you can see it looks pretty good go to the photo and now you can re-render our scene with the new material so this is the way to import uh, mega scans from quixel also the materials uh, if you find this video helpful or you learned something it's a new method that i use to create these kind of videos if you enjoyed the video also let me all know in the comments consider subscribing and if you like the video leave a like and i hopefully see you all in the next video bye